A call by the African Union to get permanent representation to the United Nations Security Council has hit a snag after it failed to get the endorsement from China's new foreign minister on Wednesday during its visit to Ethiopia. The AU chairman termed Africa's lack of permanent representation at the Security Council as a burning issue since most issues on the Council agenda are usually related to African countries. The African continent, with 1.3 billion inhabitants and 54 member states, has the right to be a member of this international governance and a permanent member of the Security Council. During the press conference, the Chinese foreign minister rejected the idea of China and U.S. competing and called for mutual respect. The China-U.S. relationship must not be one about competition. It must not be based on a win or lose zero-sum game. If that is the case, there will be no winners and the world will suffer. The relationship should be one based on mutual respect and win-win cooperation. This comes after the United States held U.S.-Africa summit in Washington last week in a bid to reassert its influence in Africa. The foreign minister has begun a week-long trip to Africa where he is also expected to visit Angola, Benin, Egypt and Gabon.